This is Bricktown Silver. Welcome to my mind. You have entered the BS zone. Well, I got today, fellas. I get to do a do-over, and you don't even know what I did. Anyway, you know, talking about do-overs, if these old boys here were still alive, I bet they wish they could do a do-over. They tried to rob two banks in one day, and uh, they didn't get either one of them robbed. They got dead. But anyway, them guys there uh, probably could have wished they could have done a do-over. Here's uh, two guys here. If you notice, they got the same ending dates. They were the citizens. I bet they wish things would have been a done over on them too because they didn't make it out of there either. There's quite a few uh, people died that day during that bank robbery. But one, oh Emmett Dalton, he uh, lived. He got shot several times, a lot of times, I tell you the truth. He had his whole all through him, but he lived and I bet he wish he had had a chance to do a do over. He. Uh, Spent a lot of years in prison, but he got wealthy after that doing real estate and things. But I still bet he wish he had a do-over. Speaking of, well, my do-over <laughs> is not a do-over. So anyway, I went ahead and I'd done this one before. I opened it all up thinking I was doing a do-over, but it was the wrong guy. But this is from Heads or Tails Living. And uh, we got a letter from him. Says to Gus and Ricky Bobby, thanks for sending me the stickers and the awesome buffaloes. Sorry, really, just getting started again. Well, good luck getting going again. That's, I guess it is a do-over. So all I can send at the moment is a sticker. That's much appreciated. We like stickers. More to come very soon. Thank you for the like and the sub. Heads or tails. Yeah, boy, heads and tails, that's a good channel. Go over there and see him, sub to him, support him. Here's a little bit of his channel right here. Boy, that is one good looking man. Wonder how he come up with that picture. But he's got 191 subscribers. He needs you to be 92. Got all kinds of little things going on. Mail calls, corn roll hunts. Uh, I think it's a corn roll hunt. Yeah, just uh, challenges, special things. I think he's even got a little bit of a, a homestead stuff going on. Anyway, you need to get over there and check him out. He's one of the boys. Anyway, uh, like I say, <laughs> it was. I've done a whole video on this thing and uh, found out I'm I looking for the sticker to do the do-over. I didn't have a sticker and uh, found out it was the wrong guy anyway. But now we got a sticker from Head or Tails. Man, look at that guy. I bet he's related, excuse me, get my tongue straight here, related to KK. Them old boys could uh, be brothers. Anyway, we got the sticker from Heads or Tails. Much appreciated. It will go on the sticker board. More coming your way soon. 11 out of 100. To Gus and Ricky Bobby. Well, thank you so much, Heads or Tails. And one of these days we'll find out if you're the head or the tail, I suppose. But as I was doing a do-over, I thought, you know, I didn't give this justice when I showed it the other day. I did it for, uh, oh, uh, remember 2020, I think it was, or what that video was, and I uh, got these, got a certificate of authenticity. I'll let you guys read that if you want to. You can stop or go anytime you want on that. But to remember 1952, this is the year that Breaktown was incorporated. Of course, it had been around for a hundred years before that, but uh, there was kind of some things I, I said uh, I thought I'd like to talk to you guys about. And it was the year of turmoil, a year of change. 
a year in which we could rejoice, 1952. That was the year that Elizabeth was coronated as Queen of England. The armistice ended the Korean conflict. UFOs were reported all over the United States. Jacqueline Boulevard became engaged to John F. Kennedy and Richard Nixon delivered his famous checkers speech over the nationwide television. Illinois beat Stanford in the Rose Bowl. Jockey Eddie Arcaio rode the Hill Gale to the Winter Circle in the Kentucky Derby and the Red Detroit Red Wings pirated home from the Stanley Cup. The greatest show on earth won the Oscar for the best picture. The African Queen with Bogart and Hepburn open to rave reviews. In the White House, the election of Dwight Eisenhower ushered in a new end of prosperity, era of prosperity. Well, that's one do-over I wish we could do uh, here lately. The New York Yankees snatched the World Series from the Brooklyn Dodgers 4-3. to three. Later that same year, Navy shut out Army 7-0 to zero in football. 1952 was the year that mechanical heart was first used to support life, human life. Coca-Cola began its famous Pause That Refreshes advertising campaign. The Werner von Braun first suggested space travel to Mars as a viable. It was a year of nationwide political unrest, labor disputes, and economic prosperity. That sounds a lot like today with the political unrest. 1952, a year of dramatic change, a year of endurance, a year to remember. Anyway, I thought I, I didn't give this uh, report here justice when I gave it the first time. This talks about the coins that's in here. Uh, so I feel like this uh, little presentation needed to have a do-over. And uh, here's the coins again. So I can get a little light on there. Old 1952s. Very good year. The year Bricktown was incorporated. Only funny thing about this, though, is kind of disappointing. Box made in China. <laughs> We're still dealing with China. We're still dealing with political unrest. We're still dealing with elections. What a mess. Anyway, I wanted to pull this out again. This guy looks like he's a mess too. But heads or tails, one way or another, we'll get it all figured out. We'll get it all worked out. Well, I rambled on enough. I don't know what I'm talking about today, but I figured I would just uh, do the mail call and uh, do a do-over. This is Breaktown Silver. God bless America. Revive the Republic. <laughs>